How you doing guys and girls? Welcome back to the channel. My name is Callum X. In today's Grounded Tips video, I'm going to show you how you can send your save game files. This is only works on PC at the moment, Steam or Windows 10. How you can send your saved game files to your friends. They can then open your saved files and they can basically play. So say, let's say, for example, if you've built an ultra amazing base, right? You built a super base and you want your friends to be able to play it, then you can literally send this file to them and they can then just open it in their game just like normal and they can go into your saved file and they can play. Absolutely amazing. Uh, we've used it to send bases between each other, like when we've done base builds, etc., etc. Really, really useful. So if you find a video useful, don't forget to smash the thumbs up button, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more grounded tips and tutorials. And of course, if you want to join us live, link to my Twitch is down in the description. We hang out six nights a week on there. So hopefully I'll see you there. First thing you need to do is head over to your C drive. Okay, so this might... It might be a different drive letter, but for most people on Windows, it's going to be your C drive. So this is your hard drive. Okay, click this PC, go to C drive. You're then going to want to go to users, pick the user that is your main username that you use. Mine's <laughs> Kalu. I don't know why it doesn't have an M on it. Uh, then you're going to scroll down. You'll see a folder down here called saved games. Double click on that. And then if you are using the Steam version of Grounded, you will have a folder that's called Grounded, like that. If you are using the Windows 10 Game Pass version, then it will say Grounded Windows 10, okay? Both of these are compatible. This is worth thinking, or this is worth remembering. So if your friend is playing on Windows 10, the Game Pass version, and you're playing on Steam, it doesn't matter. You can still send them their fi uh, your files and they can still send you theirs. It will work, you just put them into you know your folder so if we for example have a little check here if i click on grounded now you'll see all of my saved game folders just here and the date modified so this is when that was last saved okay so the easiest way that you can't tell which one's which obviously so the easiest way to ensure that you know what saved file you're going to send them is to open the one you want to send in grounded first you know go, log into grounded open the saved file you want to send them then log out so it saves itself and then when you come in here the date modified will be the most recent that will be the one you want to send them then literally all you need to do is copy that folder and paste it into your dropbox or your google drive or anywhere like that send them that entire folder all they do on the other end is they locate themselves to the same place they go to their windows c drive users their username saved games whichever folder they have for grounded and all they just do then is literally just paste click paste it will put it in there then when you load grounded for the next time that saved file will be there ready for you to open just open it jump straight in you have everything they have you can explore their base etc 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 this is also the method you would use if you had a problem with your saved file to send it to obsidian they've actually said if you have a problem with your saves then send the save file to them this is how you do it okay so guys i hope you found this video useful um it was requested by a member of the community and i've been meaning to do it for a little while but hopefully you find it useful don't forget to uh, leave a thumbs up subscribe notification bell Join me on Twitch. Link's in the description. Leave a comment below. I'll speak to you guys soon. Enjoy being small. Take care. Bye-bye.